Hi friends, in this video, I will be discussing my experience dealing with a spider mites infestation on my 100 day old eggplant growing in Aero Garden Harvest. Please note that some of the visuals might be unsettling, so please be prepared. I think it started a few weeks ago, but I haven't noticed it. It spread out so fast and went out of control. Now I have two options. Either removing the plant and starting afresh with new seeds or taking the more aggressive approach of pruning the plant significantly and allowing it to regrow. Given that this plant has been thriving and yielding excellent eggplants, I have decided to opt for the latter. I will be pruning it extensively, thoroughly washing it and giving it a chance to rejuvenate with fresh growth. Here it is. I just put it in sink. It is getting ready for cleanup. I just wanted to show you this nasty spider mite infestation closely. See how worst it is. Oh my goodness. I saw spider mite infestation many times, but I never saw at this level. Maybe I neglected this. I did not notice it on time. That spread so fast and now it's all over the plant. Let's see if cleaning the plant, removing all these leaves is going to bring the plant back. At the same time, I'm going to use these Clorox disinfecting wipes to wipe off this entire system. The system also has a lot of uh, spider mites all over this light panel. So I'm going to wipe it thoroughly. Here it is. I removed multiple branches and uh, all the leaves pretty much. There are only few young leaves left on the plant and here is everything i removed and i also wiped off this entire system thoroughly with our disinfecting wipes now i'm going to put it together and see where it will end up as i am about to clean the bowl i took the plant out and here it is in this process i also had to remove a lot of roots check this out all the roots i removed since i'm forced to remove some roots i actually went a little deep and cleaned a lot of fruits now they are looking little fresh let's see if i am giving a new life to this plant or i am taking the life of this plant all right the plant is back in the system after a thorough cleaning and getting started with the fresh water and nutrition and coming to the harvest here is the first harvest and i got 14 ounces that is close to an lb which is really good this is the reason I don't want to lose the plants. I normally pull out the plants as soon as I see any infestation, aphid or spider mites or any kind of infestation. But after seeing this excellent crop, excellent yield, I don't want to lose this plant. So I'm doing my best to keep the plant up and running. It's been five days since I cleaned the system and brutally pruned the plant and the root system. It is looking good with lots of fresh growth on the way. Let's check the root system. It looks good. Nothing suspicious. I am pretty confident that this plant survived. But I don't want to conclude it so fast. So I am going to wait 5 more days before I can claim it as success. Alright, it's been 10 days since I cleaned the plant as well as the garden. The plant is coming very healthy. Look at all this very fresh and healthy growth. Now let's take a look at the root system. Hopefully it is doing good as well. Here it is. Nothing suspicious. Looks like this plant survived. And I see some new roots coming up. That's really good news. And these roots are looking good. They are little brownish, but they are brown before my cleaning as well. So I'm not going to be worried about it. I don't see any mold or any nasty stuff here. So it is all going very healthy. So this cleaning really worked out for eggplant and this plant is happy. Hopefully I tackled the spider mites now. All right, that is all I wanted to show you about how I tackled the spider mites infestation situation. Hope this video is helpful. Thanks for watching and happy gardening.